Hello and thank you for watching this video. Let us now discuss the well-known topic for dogs which is cherry eyes. What exactly is cherry eye? So cherry eye is a red lump that is located inside your dog's eyes. The ligament that maintains this gland in place breaks or completely separates from the orbital bone, causing this condition. When this occurs, the lump prolapses and is quite noticeable on your dog's eyes. Is this contagious? Take a deep breath because if you suspect your dog has this, remember that it is not life-threatening and can be readily treated by your veterinarian. Also, because this is not contagious, relax. If you have additional dogs in the house with your dog who has this condition, they are safe and will not catch it. How can this condition be avoided in your dog? As much as we would like to know how to keep our dog from having this condition, nobody knows what caused this illness, but a vet will usually require surgery to treat it. What happens if the cherry eye is left untreated? Keep in mind that if surgery is not performed, the condition won't go away on its own or become better. Even eye drops won't solve your dog's primary issue, but they will assist it avoiding drying up its eyes. In order to quickly assess its condition, you must see a veterinarian. Avoid delaying it for a long time, as this will not be beneficial, especially if you're struggling to pay for its surgical treatment. What are the risks of this procedure? Well, if your dog underwent a removal of the gland surgery, the unslightly red lump on its eyes and the natural lubrication near your dog's eyes would be removed, and this would create dry eyes due to the absence of fluid. In addition to making your dog uncomfortable, it also impairs its vision and easily makes it hot and itchy, therefore this is not advisable. On the other hand, getting your dog's gland removed is different from the surgical repositioning surgery for cherry eyes. The goal of this procedure was to reposition it to the proper location. This course of treatment would be known to a qualified surgeon. At what age does a dog experience this? It typically occurs in puppies under a year old and is more likely to do so at this age. But it can happen to any dog at any time. French Bulldogs are among the breeds of Bulldogs that are most susceptible to this condition. What warning signs or symptoms could this condition have? Your pets typically don't experience any pain when it first begins. Your dog most likely won't even be aware of having it. This pink or red fleshy bulge around the corner of the eye is bulging. Take your dog to the nearest veterinary hospital as soon as you discover these symptoms because if left untreated, this can result in infection and chronic dry eyes. How long does healing take after surgery? It takes about two weeks but not longer than a month are needed for this to heal. Of course, you should be aware that your dog will need to wear an e collar around its neck to prevent it from scratching its eyes which could lead to an infection. Again, I want to thank you for watching and listening. Until my next video, take care!